Hello again, future happy campers. We have got a brand new 2019 Flagstaff 23 FBKS here. 4,492 easy towing pounds. Uh, you could tow this behind some SUVs, any basically any full-size pickup, half ton, three-quarter ton, doesn't matter for the most part. Even mid-size pickups would probably be very capable of towing this. So, lots of choices, and let's start here at the front, where you've got that awesome windshield, which is so great for letting in the night light, or any light for that matter. <laughs> um, so you've got your windshield, They've redone these Murphy bed models, and this does have a Murphy bed. So there's a lot more storage in the front. Check that out. Much more storage than previous generations. And you see that table in there. That's part of what you get with this. I'll show you where that goes in a minute. More ride steps. These are capable of up to 500 pounds of weight. So when your wife tells you you need to lose some weight, just tell her, no, I got the Moride steps, I'm all good. No, seriously, they're also very stable and they fold up into the door so you don't have the steps dangling down under the trailer when they're not in use. Um, these have a friction hinge and that way in a windstorm, this is not gonna go slamming closed or banging up against the side of your trailer. So another, plus feature of these Flagstaff micro lights. Uh, frameless windows. These frameless windows, not a maintenance item, they swing open from the top here with a knob on the inside. I'll show you that in a bit. Uh, so again, one less point of maintenance. Uh, this has the Wi-Fi Ranger and what the Wi-Fi Ranger does for you is it gives you amplified signal for park Wi-Fi, but also a firewall. So. It acts as a signal booster and also a way of securing your signal. Of course, you have your outdoor speaker too here. There's a light under the awning that for who knows what reason I never turned on. Eh, that's the way it is. Um, this has the Dexter Torflex axle and here's an example of that. Uh, they basically freeze these rubber bits and then put these axles together. And it is a, basically an independent suspension for all four wheels of your trailer. It's a great towing suspension, safer, better ride. Trailer's gonna last longer because it's not getting jarred around. Um, this rail here, that's where that metal table goes that I showed you a moment ago. And it comes with an outdoor barbecue that also fits into this rail. And you have your outdoor LP disconnect there so that's where you hook your barbecue you can hook your tv here in this frame and here's your uh, satellite or cable and power so there you go and the tires are filled with nitrogen did i show you the power awning already if not there it is if i did show it to you it means it's twice as nice right because i showed you twice uh, this is a water cabinet and in there is a whole trailer water filter. Pretty cool thing, filter all your water. Here's your city connection and your antifreeze inlet. And that red stuff in the water filter that you saw, uh, that is RV antifreeze. It's a food grade antifreeze because they don't know if this is going to the Midwest, sunny Southern California, beautiful Northern California. Uh, it does come equipped or it comes pre-wired rather with the Furion camera attachment. By the way, we're next to a Harley dealership. Somebody's leaving. And you have a ladder to get up on the roof. And that is one of two Max Air fans. And you can have that lid open and the fan on even in the rain, which kind of keeps your trailer moisture from building up. Pretty cool. Water heater here, six gallons at 140 degrees. Outdoor shower. Come on, you know you want to embarrass the other campers, right? No, I'm 
just kidding. It's great for washing off the dog or washing off your feet when you get back from the beach or whatnot. It's your freshwater tank fill, cable and satellite, 30 amp power. Here's a cool little bonus storage spot under the dinette. And here's the other side of under the bed storage. This one is equipped with slide topper awning. So you don't have to worry about branches in the slide. Background front where we see our power tongue jack. Our Harley friend is leaving. Dual propane tanks, which you always get full here at Redwood Empire RVs and space for two batteries. If you like boondocking or dry camping, Speaking of that, hi everybody. Uh, these trailers now come with a 58 gallon freshwater uh, tank. So more freshwater, longer boondocking. Okay, let's go inside. I'll show you one of the reasons we love these Flagstaff travel trailers. That's your Murphy bed, by the way. Here, come and, come and sit with me, Sonny. I'll tell you a story. Uh, this is a wall section of how these trailers are made. It's a laminate, so you have your outer wall, an inner wall, and then insulation or an aluminum stud. This thing is, it, you have to come here to feel how light this is, but it's really light and really strong. Now, as if that were not enough, this is a roof section. Look how thick that is. The Flagstaff travel trailers all have fully walkable roofs. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Even I can walk up there. So it's much thicker. And then you have again insulation and a thick aluminum rib. So pretty cool. Um, these couches in the new Flagstaffs have footrests. So you can sit here, relax, have a drink or whatever. Um, I'll show you how these windows work. They are sort of a Jalousie style. They twist open for fresh air and then lock in place. You always have your blinds here. Next to the Murphy bed is a closet and they go all the way down. These newer ones do. So it's a taller, deeper closet, but then there's a drawer here and it's full extension. Oh, this is a little table. There are two of these and they go right here in this hole in the couch. See, there's a spot for it to go and it slides in. So you have a little table. Okay, now I want to show you the Murphy bed because we hear a lot of people say, nah, I don't want that Murphy bed. That's too much work. Okay, so start your timers, everybody. Here comes Tony with one hand, and I'll show you how quick and easy this is. Grab that strip. Couch is flat. And the bed is counterweighted. So with one hand, sleepy time. How many seconds was that? Not many, right? So you can leave the bed made up and ready to go. They're nice. They put a shelf there. And then down at the end of the bed, there's a 110 outlet. And you have that beautiful windshield to look out of. Now, there's nothing to say you can't leave this down all the time if you choose to, but you have options. Options are good. Um, we've outfitted this one with a second Max Air fan, and again, that one has that cover, so you can turn that on in the night and get quite a nice breeze. And if you like boondocking, which is dry camping or off-grid camping, those Max Air fans make a big difference and they run off your battery. So, okay, let's look at this. You have your pantry here. Uh, the two covers on the sink, drain rack cutting board have your nice high-rise sink faucet dual well stainless steel sink I sink therefore I am I love puns your microwave you have a 
three burner stove. I can imagine how many people just said, yeah, well, we don't. And then your oven. More space above. It's actually a really deep cabinet. And again, this is a smaller 23 foot interior length travel trailer, yet a lot of features and a lot of flexibility. Your dinette turns into a bed. Not as easily as that Murphy bed, but not far behind. You have your Furion TV, and these are designed for the jolts and jars that <clears throat> the trailer experiences going down the road. Again, that Moride axle does, or the Torflex axle does mitigate a lot of that, but it's still, man, if you've driven California roads, they're rough. You have a sound bar included, AM, FM, DVD, CD player. This is your Wi-Fi Ranger. Turn it on and off if you want to boost your signal. Lots of cabinets over the dinette. <clears throat> you have central air conditioning. And it's a Coleman mock system, so those are nice and quiet. And it's ducted throughout the ceiling. I showed you how thick that ceiling is, so they can do this. They can duct the air conditioning right through the ceiling. Here's your antenna. You pick up all those digital TV stations that a lot of cities have. And off to the bathroom. And one of the reasons people really like this floor plan is it's a huge bathroom for such a smaller trailer. I know that guy. They have put a new 360 siphon vent cap on the uh, sewer pipe. So you won't be playing that song. Ooh, that smell. It's a decent sized sink, a nice composite shelf up here, medicine cabinet. Um, this Check out the size of this bathroom closet. And then, by the way, it includes an outdoor barbecue and that's it. Um, here's your RV foot flush toilet. And this one has the heated uh, tanks so you won't have to worry about winter camping another closet in the bathroom a second max air fan this is the one you saw the vent cover on from the outside and then this huge shower nice corner shower with the ceiling skylight in case you're exceptionally tall you have a nice bag to put your toiletries in um, water saver. What this does is when you're waiting for the hot water to get to the shower, you flip that valve and that water goes back into your freshwater tank. So you're not wasting a bunch of water. Uh, then once this sheath changes color, the water's hot, flip on your shower, you're good to go. So boondocking in these, you get more out of one. And that's why we like these flagstaffs. They just give you more. They've clearly spent time camping. Well, there you have it. See why we like these flagstaff travel trailers so much. Very high quality construction. Lots of great features in a nice small package. Uh, as I say, uh, when we started carrying the flagstaff, all three of us bought one, all of our sales team. Um, so they're just great trailers. This, again, under 5,000 pounds, easily towable by just about any half-ton truck, mid-sized truck, SUVs, whatnot. So there you go. Redwood Empire RVs. My name is Tony, but you can ask for any of us. We're all here to help us. Uh, our website's open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. We've got all our inventory. Our pricing is right there up front. And our pricing always includes your propane, your battery, your full walk-around, your hoses, connectors, we don't mess around. We get you going. You could literally go right from our dealership to a campground and be ready to go. You'd probably want to stop for beer. I know I would. Anyway, uh, thank you for watching and uh, happy camping, everybody.